Good morning, investors and traders. This is Naim Azam, Chief Market Analyst at Evertrade, and welcome to our daily technical analysis video. As you may have known, Ethereum has made a new record high, folks. And now the question is, how high will it go? And that is exactly what we are going to address in this video. So let's have a deeper conversation on Ethereum and other cryptos. Before we do that, as always, it is important for us to go through this slide of disclaimers and risk warnings. Anything which will be discussed in this video cannot be perceived as an advice. If you are seeking for all, please do consider consulting with your own financial advisors. Now, as always, I'm going to bring out the MT4 platform. And from here, we will perform our price analysis. On the daily chart, as always, I have three different moving averages, beginning with 50 day simple moving average, which is in pink, followed by that is your 100 day simple moving average, and finally, your 200 day simple moving average. Now, given the fact that the price is trading above these moving averages, it indicates that yes the, the bulls are very much in control of the price and if you see any of our previous videos it will become very clear to you that we have talked about uh, ethereum prices crossing coming close uh, to that 1500 price level which we have now but the fact is that this was really going to happen because ethereum prices never started their massive rally they've only sort of recovered the losses and then but rally only started to move uh to into a next gear when the price crossed above that 1300 price level but you know after that the price did see a bit of a retracement and then we had another retest of this particular price level the price did go slightly above that but then price started to move lower so over from here to here we were very much in a, in a consolidation zone with a, a small vix to which were violating the previous highs and of course uh so the price continues to make higher lows which was a clear indication that yes the price is likely to continue its journey to the upside and we are very much likely to see a higher highs in addition to that the price was also trading in this particular pattern and as you can see now we are breaking out of this upward wedge pattern and this means the price can really move to a new level so what is that new level that new level is really going to push the prices above the 1900 price level so for me the new target when it comes to ethereum prices i'm going to type that on the chart so that you know and then you don't forget that uh, so let me put that over here uh, and i will say the next target for eth is okay here we go this is the target that i believe the price can really achieve in terms of ethereum so now give uh, we have broken out of this upward wedge and prices will rise are very much likely to rise from here and then really push us towards that 1900 to 2000 price level so that is what we are really looking at but one thing that we do need to pay attention to is that rsi is very much close enough to that uh, critical level of 70 which is associated with overbought or uh, price levels uh, meaning that the price is or uh, is, is an overbought territory so retracement can happen so this breakout that we are seeing it could very much be turn out to be you know as a fake breakout and if that happens the price will very quickly move below this up the the below this line the upper line of this upward channel but rsi can move quite high and it can go all the way to nine above 90 
when it comes to the uh, to crypto's RSI. So I wouldn't really pay too much attention to the to the uh, to the RSI. Wouldn't get too much boggled about it. What I really wanted to focus now is that what you wanted to keep an eye is that okay now the price is trading at fifteen sixty one, which is very much the highs of the day. Can the price stay above? the upward line of this wedge pattern and if it does then that is all good but if we can't then obviously we are likely to see the price moving into a new territory so what we're going to do is right where the price is breaking above the upward line we're going to draw a horizontal line and now we are going to go into our four hour time frame and from our four hour time frame what the, the purpose that we are we, we really wanted to achieve from here is okay what is the level where we want the prices to stay above now in in all reality we want the price to stay above the the, the critical price level which i'm about to draw on the chart because we don't want price to drop certainly below this critical price level so let's just say we certainly do not want the prices to go below the 1455 price level if there is a retracement and that retracement is happening because the price is breaking out above the upward channel then the retracement should only push the price towards the price level that I have mentioned over here is this this particular area we should not see prices dropping below these these price levels because if price retraces all the way back to its 50 day simple moving average on a four hour time frame it is really going to show us that the momentum is dying off to a larger extent now having said that we can even go into a further smaller term time frame and then this is where your 50 day simple moving average is trading at and that is above that price level the 1455 price level that we have described and uh, so according to that so this is the area of support so we want the price to stay above the 1484 which would make a lot of sense in terms of this price so as long as we stay above that 1484 price can certainly come and kiss this 50 day simple moving average but we don't want the price to break above it but overall what the price is telling us is that the 50 is trading above the 100 100 is trading above the 200 so all stars are very much in line and that means the prices are likely to see higher highs for ethereum right that's all for now and then i'll see you guys next time